So we're just pouring now distilled water on a 14 inch mirror. Not regular water. Okay. Uh, Triple just, distilled water. Yeah, don't point the mirror at yourself Whoa, with a sun at your <laughs> face. <laughs> it's just a warm flash. That's, uh, uh, well, at least you're not at the focal length. <laughs> the focal point. It's when the burning scar goes across your chest. So what is this that you're putting? This is now cotton and... Oh. Same thing? No, don't tilt it. No, just kind of hold it up. Yeah, put some of this stuff in there. And then... Uh, it's not one drop flat, of... unfortunately. One drop of Dawn liquid so with a uh, gallon. Let's get water. it so I can get a puddle. Maybe uh, scooch it this way in the table because the table's probably got a well in the center. Yeah, there you go. See it. Okay. Now, we put this the on motion YouTube. Is, is simply sure. this circular motions, no pressure. And you just kind of slosh it around. Hmm. I said that doesn't look really discolored, but I guess we're just trying to take like an organic film off of it so. It's not like we're trying to... And this particular mirror had uh, or dewed up and then had uh, dirt on it and then everything froze and so the stuff stuck to the mirror as far as we can tell. So we're just cleaning the mirror at this point. This is a fresh part of the cotton now. This is a new piece? Uh, the other side. Other that side. I was holding. Okay. Want me to build the towel up under the other end to cool the water better? It seems like it's doing fine. Okay. We're getting good. We're about done with the washing. We're about ready to rinse. Mm -hmm. Where'd you get this cotton? Uh, hunted around different uh, drug stores. Okay. Yeah, I think it said Rite Aid on it. Yeah, this is what uh, Creepy and then uh, uh, Richard Berry all say to use. So hmm. I just go with that. <laughs> now rinse. Well, I'm actually not rinsing yet. Yep. I'm just, we had so much soapy water here. I feel like I might as well use it. You know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Got enough to wash everybody's mirror. Okay, let's. Uh, yeah, give me one more piece of that, that stuff. Okay, as long as we're out here, let's do the owner's job. And it will leave little fibers and it doesn't matter because it'll, it'll blow off eventually during the night. Okay, oh, it looks like the Pleiades reflecting in the water droplets. <laughs> yeah. Look, from right here. <laughs> You're blind now. <laughs> yeah, okay, you... let's t do the 45 degrees and hold for, we're going to be doing this for a few minutes. Man, this is going to take a while, so get a comfortable position. Okay. A little bit safe. Cleaning a mirror out in the field. Had, uh, technicians when we were making big gold mirrors, they'd sit there and rinse mirrors for half a day, four hours, just pouring water on the mirror. Mm. Well, clean your mirror. Mm -hmm. Whoa, I just got a little flash of that light. It's, yeah. pretty, it's warm. John Bunyan is? In the trailer. Is he? Uh, yeah, he was a minute ago. Oh, I forgot. We had to hold it sort of at a fairly steep angle to dry, but it'll dry really quick if it's clean. You won't see the little beads of water. Or if they, we'll have to dab up a couple little beads. Because that's usually where there's a scratch, a little micro scratch and stuff. Mm -hmm. Seeing how the water pours on a mirror and beads up tells you a lot about its surface. Hmm. That's probably good enough. 
leg is about this amount from my mirror. And yours is a 41 inch mirror. <laughs> so yeah, you're probably right. Okay, but yeah, just kind of let it go like that. We get a fresh piece of cotton here. It's just a little, this prevents a streak like this next thing. And one of the main reasons why you want to use this cotton is because you're going to sit here and literally dab the mirror. Get the little droplets small enough so they'll evaporate and not sit there and puddle and leave a film. That's what happened to you, right? You see, this is... Yeah, it's leaving cotton fibers all over. That's okay, don't worry about that. All right. By, the, by about eight or nine o'clock tonight, it'll be, they'll be gone. Because that cotton I've got is probably more absorbent, and as it says, lint-free on it. No, I'm, I'm trying to just make them smaller. Oh. I'm trying to not touch the mirror at all. That's the part of the. That's why they say never wash your mirrors because you're just you're just, you're. This the film on this thing's so darn thin. And a little at the center, although you'll never use that part of the mirror. I like your target. That's cool. Yeah, it works really well. And who coated this mirror again? Spectrum. Spectrum Coatings in Florida. Did you put the little dot on it? Or did you get yeah, no, he center, center marked it. And okay. This is their Max R coating. Okay, there, you can just set it straight up there. You mean lay flat? Yeah, lay flat. Like that. Let's go. Man, it looks a lot brighter. Good. Wow. Okay. So, let's see. Tell us your names again and your rank and your file and everything. Joe Blow. Joe Blow. Okay. <laughs> And, this is, and I'm Joe. Okay. And I'm Joe as well. How about lo, the two Chris's? <laughs> All right. You get to put it back together again. Probably want to make sure it's dry and before you put it back together. Just so you don't put any moisture in the tube, you know? Maybe okay. sit on another dry towel or something. Whoa. Holy smokes. Yeah, don't get in the way of that. Feels like it's the intensity of the sun. Hey, I wonder why. Okay, good job, everybody.